All right, welcome back to Dominions 4. So we're playing the Maverni, and I am using a astral strategy which focuses a lot on um, using Stellar Cascades with an army of Sequani, as I have right now. Um, this is a smaller army of Sequani over here, not quite as big or intimidating as this. It does require I have somebody with astral skill 2 at least, and I'm looking around. I don't have that exactly yet. Um, I do in this army, right? We have uh, Viridovix. And what that means is I need to recruit a few more of these Elder Druids, because they're guaranteed going to have Astral 2, which is what I need to make this strategy work. So we're going to put him in there. All right, next. We have Baratos doing... You know, whatever. As long as they leave me alone, I'll let them keep this province. They can have it. Uh, of big concern is over here, Abyssia. We see Abyssia over here on this border, and we see Ob Abyssia over here. So they are... I guess maybe they're not... Well, but then they're up here as well. So Abyssia seems to be a, one of the larger empires right now, and right now I'm, I'm working on... Uh, I'm working on Miklan, right? So... You know, and they're harassing me over here as well. We got a huge province defense there. I'm uh, assembling another follow-up army there. Uh, Fulla, I need to decide what to do with you. And I think, first of all, let's go ahead and transfer these gems over. I think... What are my ritual uh, abilities here? Hmm... Yeah. Ten nature gems to do the monster boar. And what he does is ravage farmlands and causes unrest until it's found and slain. I think that's more good for multiplayer games than it is for this particular one. And, you know, I really am tempted to have her just keep forging stuff. So... Uh, I think somebody's forging that. Book of Manual or Manual of Water Breathing could be useful. I honestly think the Cure All Elixir is going to be very useful. Uh, the, man, we need more nature gems. And uh, I've used up quite a few of them. I could start getting her equipped for. What does this one do again? Poison resistance and luck. Eh, it's okay. Uh, Ice Shield. All of these cost nature, of course. Vine Bow. Ice Pebble Staff. Mm. Yeah. Sort of Swiftness. Interesting. Interesting. Versus the Ice Brand. I almost think this is a better... I think I might like this weapon better. Well, let's make one. Okay. And, uh, yep. So, these guys over here, what am I going to do with you? Let's just build up our defense here, okay? So we took that from the independent trolls, and we see over here what we've got with Abyssia. And, uh, you know, we can't... Could we build a temple? You know what we ought to do? Ah, uh, we need more money, though. We ought to build palisades. I think that's what we will do. So, let's see. Where are we recruiting junk that we don't need? Don't... Uh, over here, actually, we should start recruiting some Sequani. So, we'll do that there. And I'm going to leave it alone up there. What we did do is I think we still put a bunch of province defense in here. So let's... Oh, nope, that was last turn, huh? Okay, well, dang. Um, okay, well, I do want to get my... Um, I, I do want to get a palisade started, so I'm going to do that. And... Uh, construct palisades. Palisades. 
patrol, uh, search, and the rest of you guys just, you know, do your thing. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. But this is a good choke point. So, yeah, we're going to definitely build a palisade there. And then back at the base, can we, do we have enough to get him? Nope. Well, there we go. We'll just have to wait another turn before we start. Well, what we could do is we could do this. Take him off. Take him off. Okay. Still can't do it, huh? Well then, take these guys off, well, except for the one, I guess. I may have flubbed that a bit. There we go. Got them. Keep recruiting these sacred units because they're good, and I have a good bless. I think I have a good bless. Uh, where are you? You cannot do much of anything, so patrol. Uh, what is patrol again? X. Oh, but it has to be shift X. Okay. Okay, that will keep you guys busy for a bit. Until I'm ready. Okay. End. End the turn. Not all undead are lifeless or mindless. We saw that a little bit ago. Saw that message earlier. Research is complete. No magic sites were found. And you're attacking me in Elidor. Yes, we've seen this army. I'm not concerned. I do not fear the Reaper. I just realized now my next Battle Brothers company name. Anyway, um, so I'm enjoying playing, uh, you know, experimenting with strategies in Dominions 4 single player, but uh, I've really been enjoying the multiplayer game. I've been playing with uh, Dwarf Comic. If you haven't taken a look, I recommend checking it out. I really enjoy it, and I think it's a lot more interesting to play against other players. I'm doing terrible in the game. I won't. Uh, I won't deny that. Uh, I chose a strategy that um, I think is very suboptimal for the faction that I picked. Uh, and I'm not playing it well. But it's a lot of fun and it's interesting. And I think I'm going to try to focus on playing multiplayer Dominions more. Um, so uh, I hope that that's this, I hope that's enjoyable to watch. Uh, it may be kind of like watching, you know, your four-year-old kids play soccer <laughs> where it's like <laughs> I'm not sure I'm not sure if it's that like <laughs> it may be like that um, but if it's like that watching me play multiplayer it's probably like that watching me play single player too so anyway um, but if uh, you do like the multiplayer games um, man he is doing kind of good um, the spells are m messing with me. Yeah, let's get our stats going up, too. Um, if, uh, you know anybody else, because I am still looking for potential, uh, people to play with, I want to play, I want to play multiplayer with, uh, other people on YouTube. Um, probably my main reason, because I want to maintain a certain degree of, uh, civility, and I guess not to be too highfalutin about it, but professionalism um, with the people I play with. So, you know, like try to mitigate rage quitting. And that's for me as well as anyone else. Uh, you know, like when you're playing with somebody else and it's part of their channel's content as well, then, uh, you know, I feel I feel I have a little bit more obligation to, you know, uh, not be not be snippy or you know to not be a bad player um bad players and like not be a bad loser and not be you know not not rage quit and stuff like that stuff that i do when i play single player um 
And so that's why I kind of want to do it with other people who are on YouTube is also the reliability. Like, I enjoy watching the multiplayer games on YouTube, but uh, one thing that sometimes disappoints me and disappoints the person who's recording the episode, too, is uh, when you play with people who aren't online or aren't doing it or who aren't recording the episodes for, like, YouTube or whatnot. Um, let's view our storming of the castle. I don't know how this is going to go because that fight was a bit of a tough one there. Yeah, I think we'll be okay, but... Uh... Anyway, uh, to finish what I was saying, um, hmm. yeah, we, we took some hits there. We got a lot of high druids here, too. You know that? Um, anyway, the other thing, too, is if you play with somebody on YouTube, like, uh, I think it makes for, for uh, well, what I was going to say is, like, uh, you know, people, I think, would have less, they, they would have, uh, I don't know, they'd be less likely to just quit in the middle of a game and go AI controlled, which, uh, I remember I was watching It's Moo, I like his channel quite a bit, um, and he's very entertaining to watch, uh, but he lamented in one of his games, about, you know, oh, I was just starting to play against a human player finally, and then they quit. And, um, you know, it's, it's because that's just a person playing in their free time, and, and they felt like they'd lost the game, so they, they quit. Uh, but you want, that doesn't make as entertaining a viewing, and nor uh, as entertaining for him either when he was playing. And uh, I know he plays on something awful, which I don't, because I can't, because you have to pay to play on something awful, I think. But anyway, uh, I want to play with some other people who are recording it. And I also think it'll make more interesting videos because there's a lot of times when I'm watching those people play and it's like, I'd really like to hear what the other person was thinking. And uh, when everybody involved is recording their own videos, then you get a chance to go. Because I certainly have questions going on with uh, uh, Dwarf Comic as far as like, what what is he doing? <laughs> but, um, but he knows the answers to that and the answers are in his videos. And... Uh, you know, it's also entertaining for me to be able to go back and watch and see his videos too. So uh, that's something I'd really like to do in the future with Dominions. I think it keeps. I think the game is very interesting that way. I hope it makes interesting viewing, and uh, it's something I'd like to do. And uh, I'm gonna try to contact a few more YouTubers and see if I can get anybody else interested in uh, playing and sharing sharing the game footage online. And uh, if you know anybody I that you would like me to contact that or might be in my play level that I haven't thought of uh, you know be sure and let me know uh, I do want to try to play against people that are my skill level as well because I don't want to just get raffle stomped which um, I would be afraid of I think playing with uh, it's moo uh, I know he says he's not a good player but I've watched his videos and he's a better player than I am <laughs> um, but he's played more multiplayer than I have, too. Like, this game with Dwarf Comic is my very first multiplayer game ever. But, uh, man, I think I think Dominions really shines when you play multiplayer. So, anyway, I've uh, just been talking through all the uh, battle messages. I haven't sped it up or anything, so hopefully, uh, if you weren't interested in what I was saying, you were at least able to follow along with what happened in the battle there. So, in our first battle... Uh, yeah, I thought we lost a great boar carnus. That's too bad. Uh, these guys are just fodder. Boar warriors, fine. Great boars, I can deal with that. Uh, finally lost our dire wolf. Uh, and then at the fortress, uh, we only lost a couple noble warriors, so that went just fine. Okay. Unexpected event in Anfalia. Village well has turned... I do not know what this means. I'm sure somebody's going to tell me eventually, or I'll just look it up. Uh, Helmet of Heroes. Why couldn't I get this kind of good luck in my other game? Like, that's another thing that was happening in my game against Dwarf Comic, because I was just getting all these really dumb, bad events. And I got a few good ones, but, man, but this is awesome. Holy cow. Forced of Gia? Gila? Yeah, like, this isn't great, but... Patrolling troops have killed five filthy brigands. Okay. But... Yeah. Helmet of Heroes. Well, let's find out what that is. <laughs> um, 
magic item repository. Oh, it's not that great. Inspirational plus two. Uh, protection on the head is 19. Eh, it's, yeah, it's good. It's good. Let's not poo-poo it. Let's not poo-poo it yet. Um, unfortunately, you are not in a position to take it with you. Okay. Anybody... Oh, but you guys over here, you could wear it. There's a lab over here, isn't there? Yeah. First gate. Blood magic bonus 10. Wow. A library. Oh, awesome. We can recruit a sage. Not that I really need a sage at this point, but I mean, I'm doing fine on my research. Uh, let's see. Diseased, huh? Okay, well, we need to fix that, and we can fix that, because now we're at our uh, repository of goodness. Let's see. You. Hmm. Well, let's give these guys their uh, astral pearls, because I definitely want them to have it. You can have the Astral Pearl and that, and then you can wear the Sea Robe thingy. And uh, you're my main leader. Inspirational plus five. Why don't I give you that? Now you're going to just be incredibly inspirational. You are just full of heroism. Hmm. Small area of cold. You're not really a melee fighter. You, Doomdog, you get to have something. I'm going to give you the Sword of Swiftness. Okay? So please go forth and eliminate. Okay. Very good. Very good. And over here, let's recruit some Sequani. Okay. And let's bolster up our defense a bit. There we go. Okay. Looks like the monkeys are down here. Mictlan. Um. Shadows and dust walkers. Wow, this one. Uh, yeah, that unit, that set of units has been decimated. Um, there we go. That's still way better than... <laughs> that's still much better to set up, so... Who is in that group up here? I'm trying to figure out... Here it is. Guard commander. That's not where your commander is, though. So get over here. Okay. And uh, let's recruit some more uh, fodder. So I think we're going to go with bare-chested warriors. Or no, not bare-chested warriors. Noble warriors? But these guys have... Hmm. Our limiting factor over here is resources. So, hmm. Um, I guess we'll try javelin ears then, and get as many of those as possible. And a slinger. Okay, because we need to refill a little bit. Um, you've got that. How about you construct a temple, and what kind of fortification is it? Just a palisades, that's right. Uh, it was pointed out to me much earlier, and I forgot to mention this as well, that um, these castle improvements maybe aren't worth it. The administration bonus you get is maybe not worth it, so I am going to leave it alone. Uh, that seems sound to me. So, actually, we ought to search this province. It's probably been searched quite a bit, but uh, you can do that. Uh, search for magic sites. And I'm going to have to sneeze in just a sec. <coughs> Sorry about that. Search for magic sites. All right. Construct temple. 
you can search for magic sites as our holy. Um, actually, why don't you... What's wrong with me? No, no, no. You preach. Yeah. Between these two, we get everything covered. Actually... Okay, hang on. Can you build a temple? Yes. Okay, good. Then you can preach. You can preach. Preach, preach, preach. Patrol, search. Okay, looks good. Looks good there. Let's move you guys in to this province. And we'll use you to take that out and uh, give you guys one turn before we move into that province, because I want that cannon fodder back. Oh, goody. Okay, you're just a regular priest. You come over here and build a uh, temple, please. Okay, Fula. Forge a magic item. Probably need more... Yeah, 19. Okay, Liscus. Ah, they took it back from him. Okay. Um, hmm. Again. Not sure... How I want to deal with this. Maybe move you in. We'll start building up an army here and prepare. How's Gluttony doing? He's not full up, is he? No, okay. Keep, uh. Yep, as long as you guys keep spawning your boars, that's good. Okay. Alright, we got a guy here. Just research. Okay, and it's just full of... Um, kind of tempted to give her earth magic. How much would it take to empower her? 50. Hmm. Thing is, is if I did that, she could start using some better spells. I've got so much earth right now. I'm probably being stupid. I ought to use this for uh, summons. Uh, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. She'll get to use Strength of Gaia. I can give her Earth Boots. She'll even be even better. Yeah, we're gonna do it. Sorry. You searched and found nothing. Construct a temple. Alright. That's it. Diseased? No. Lost both arms! Oh. Oh, you poor, poor man. Oh, man. Oh, boy. That's terrible. Uh, we're going to be there for a little bit longer, so let's get some more sequani down there. Okay. Then they'll move. Can they move there? No, they can't. That's a very, very dumb move. There you go. And then you can move in there, and then we can start going in with our Squanny again. All right. That's going to do it. And that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, thanks for watching. And when we come back... We're going to arrange to get this throne here. I don't know why Miklan didn't take it. And then we'll take this throne. Yeah, we're just going to clean up Miklan. Uh, we'll leave these mountains here for now. And... Yeah, I guess maybe we will go ahead after the... Uh, we haven't declared war with Abyssia, so we're okay on that front. And uh, we'll just move in on the... Uh, uh, what are they called again? Oh, gosh, why can't I remember? 
Uh, nation overview, nope. Score graphs. Uh, Agartha, thank you. And how are we doing on thrones? We still only have two throne points. Throne of the moon. Oh, that's a two-point throne up there, huh? Great. Happy to hear that. Okay. Thanks for watching. Talk to you next time. Till then, bye-bye.